Hey, welcome to another episode of Candy Reads. So I kind of got the idea for Candy Reads from CBC Radio's Canada Reads. I was thrilled that when I was guest hosting on Q, I got to reveal the five Canada Reads finalists for this year, and now I'm trying to read through them all. I've got three of them done. This is one of them. This is called And the Birds Rain Down. It was originally written in French, so it was actually called Il Pleuvait des Oiseaux. Des Oiseaux. Des Oiseaux. Des Oiseaux. Il pleuvait des oiseaux, and it is by the author Jocelyn Saussier, and she is actually from New Brunswick, I was thrilled to find out, same province I'm from, but it was translated into English by Rhonda Mullins. It's a very fast read, it's 155 pages. It is surprisingly captivating. Um, the story is basically about two old men in their 80s who are living off the grid in the woods and a couple of new characters show up, one being a photographer, a female photographer who I'm guessing is somewhere in her 50s and an 80 year old woman who has escaped from an insane asylum. And that sounds like what? But it was fabulous. I read this book in one day. I could not put it down. The only strange thing that happened, and I'm going to email the, the company, is starting at page 100. So the book is going along normally. And then all of a sudden uh, I flip from page 100 and I have an email. It's not part of the book. It's like somebody's email about Subway, like the sub, Subway. And then the next page is normal. And then you turn the page again. And again, it's some weird correspondence. And it happens for a, a run of about five or six pages. And in some places, it's like even cut off on the side of the book. So I lost out on those pages. So I don't know if there's like a whole bunch of them that had this misprint in them, or if it's just mine or what have you, but I am going to email the publisher to say what up with that. So the, th the theme of Canada Reads this year is one book that could change the world. So um, they each kind of have real uh, strong themes to them. And I would say the theme of this one is aging and dying. And uh, even if you are not close to the end of life, um, it is really, really a heart wrenching heart pulling read so I would highly recommend it um, and the birds rain down those of you who are lucky enough to speak French uh, Nathalie from uh, Balmoral I know that are you from Balmoral or Eel, Eel River it's one of my viewers from the North Shore where I'm from uh, and I know that she is French I think anytime you can read a book in the original language it was written in you get an extra treat I'm obsessed with all things Russian including Russian books and Boy, to be able to speak Russian just so that you could read all those great Russian classics in Russian would be pretty fantastic. Big thumbs up. And The Birds Rain Down by Jocelyn Saussier. I definitely recommend it. Make sure you follow me on Goodreads and give me a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next one.